Welcome back everybody. New for you right now at 5 o'clock. We are not the only ones getting more active with the warmer weather. Scientists say there has been a big spike in tick bites and that's just over the past few weeks. In fact, 57 ticks have been sent to the Connecticut Department of Environmental Sciences so far this month to be tested for various diseases. Meteorologist Connor Lewis is live with more on how the weather plays a role in this year's tick population. Connor. Yeah, guys, so ticks never fully hibernate. Now, the winter did slow them down for a few weeks, but now we've done this 180. We've gone from below average temperatures to above average temperatures, which means, unfortunately, ticks are out in full force as of right now. As the uh, weather warms up, uh, this risk will be greater. Experts say this tick season will be worse than last year due to a variety of factors. Because of COVID pandemic, people would, would be at greater risk of uh, being bitten by ticks and uh, being getting infected with tick-borne diseases. Plus, spring is off to a warm start. At this point, the only thing that could slow the ticks down is a drought or a lack of hosts. There are also good indication that we are dealing with a good population of uh, hosts. Uh, non-human hosts, including deer and, and rodents. 50% of ticks in Connecticut are infected with one or more diseases. Unfortunately, it is no longer just the Lyme disease. We are dealing with a number of uh, emerging uh, tick-borne diseases. It's, uh, it's a little disconcerting that the more, the, the, the farther we get along, uh, the more uh, diseases that are prevalent um, nowadays. Um, so yeah, we got to be careful with, uh, with our pets, with our families. And you know the drill. Every time you come back from spending time outside to indoors, you got to check yourself for ticks. And a big help is also going to be wearing long sleeves, long pants. So my outfit right now is actually perfect tick proof gear, but I'm super comfy right now. It's in the 60s. It's cloudy outside. I'm feeling good. For some folks, tomorrow when we hit the 70s, you might think about putting on some shorts and a t-shirt to enjoy the nice weather. But if you're spending a lot of time in the woods tomorrow, you may want to reconsider that outfit. Maybe shorts aren't the best. Maybe wearing pants would be best because we are now officially in that tick season. Guys.